What's going on, man? Hey, you got a uh, you got a moment? Let me ask you a question, man. What's your ethnicity? Huh? What is it? I can't hear. Oh, Middle Eastern. From where? Somewhere? Are you Jewish? What are you? Are you Arab? Oh, Arab. Okay. Let me ask you something, man. Are you Muslim? Oh, you're a Muslim. Okay, so is Muhammad is Muhammad a prophet? Yeah, uh, I'm just, just have this discussion. Is Muhammad a prophet? Do you believe he's a prophet? He might be. I mean, what kind of Muslim are you? Do you believe in your book, or do you believe? Or you don't believe in the book? Read out. Because we believe the Bible. Right. Huh. We believe the whole Bible, okay? And we're not Jews. We are the true Hebrew Israelites in the Bible speaks. That's right. That's right. Not the, not, not the fake people that are in Israel today. Those are so-called white people, right? Caucasians. Now, are you a Muslim? I'm asking you. So do you believe in the Quran? Now, let me ask, okay. Do you speak Arabic? Right? you speak Arabic? So what is the word for prophet? Bring it out. Nebi, right? Now, can you, uh, can you bring out the Shahada? What's the Shahada? The Shahada doesn't call him a prophet, does it? No, it doesn't. Because the word right there is Rasul, right? So why isn't he called a prophet? He's not a prophet. That's right! Hey, what sure is that, Ak? The surah. Well, he's our king. He is our king, man. Moses, he was, he was a man that the Most High God chose to free us out of slavery in Egypt. Now, let me read you something, man. Okay? Muhammad is not a prophet. That's okay? right! You guys don't even call him a prophet in your shahada. You guys call him Rasul. Yeah, he, that, that, that's what the shahada says. He's, he, I mean, you guys call him Rasul. In your shahada, right? Why in the shahada doesn't call him Nebi? Right? Because he's not a prophet. But now let me read you something in your book. Right? Read. It's Sirach 5, oh, 4516. And we did certainly give the children of Israel Who? The children of Israel This is your book It says that we have given the children of Israel uh -huh. The scripture and judgment and prophethood And prophethood Okay, now you give me Amos 2 and 11 So the reason why you guys don't come Huh? But like, check this out You're going into slavery That's Right! The Bible says that. Right? They're deaf to Ishmael, man. What happened? Come on, brother. What would you say? I can't hear you. Come over here, brother. What'd you say? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm Zebulon. This is just a call right here. Yeah, come on, come on. Oh, Yahuda. Okay, now, hey, brother. All right, no sweat. Are you keeping the laws, though, brother? Are you keeping the laws? No sweat, brother. But now, man, give me Deuteronomy 10 and 12 right quick. Let me read you something, brother, because you know you're an Israelite, right? Let me, let me read you something. Give me... All right, no sweat. So, well, absolutely. I'm not saying you're not. But I'm saying this is you acknowledge that... You acknowledge you're an Israelite. All right, you give me Ecclesiastes 12 and 13. Read. Deuteronomy chapter 10 verse 12 Bring it out. And now Israel What doth the Lord thy God require of thee? Alright now Israel Ban Yahawadah son of Judah What does God require of you? Uh huh But to fear the Lord thy God To walk in all his ways and That's how you fear the Most High You reverence the Most High By walking in all his ways Read And to love him and To love him Alright How do we love him? Read 
and to serve the Lord thy God with all thy heart. To serve the Most High with all our heart. Our heart in the Hebrew is the mind. Read. And with all thy soul to keep the commandments. To keep his commandments. So that's how we that's how we love the Most High. So I didn't know that. Read. To keep the commandments of the Lord and his statutes, which I command thee this day for thy good. So it hey, our laws is for our good, brother. One more. Let me read you one more, brother. All right, no sweat. We're out here every Saturday, man. Okay? All right, no sweat, brother. All right. Just read it out for the camera. Ecclesiastes 12 and 13. Let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. Fear God and keep his commandments. That's the whole conclusion of matter, right? Read. For this is the whole duty of man. That's the whole duty of man. That's the whole duty of us, man. Right? right. Now give me a... Is that... What do you have? Oh, for, for, yeah, yeah, yeah. For, for, for Ishmael. He ran, though. He ran. Yeah, Ishmael knows uh, Muhammad is a prophet, right? I want another Muslim to, ask, to answer me that, man. I haven't had a direct answer from a Muslim on that yet, man. Right? What's up, bro? What's going on? Yo. What's up, my man? I, I got a question. Are you Arab? Yeah, sort of. I, I got a question, man. Are you a Muslim? Hopefully you're a Muslim, man. Right? Good. I got a question for you guys, man. Do you speak Arabic? No? Man, you won't be able to answer this. But check this out. Do you know what line you, you, you descend from? So, Muslim, uh, Arabs aren't Ishmael? Ishmael? Ishmael, right? Now, I want to ask you something. Why do Muslims believe that, Ish, uh, that Ishmael was going to, uh, uh, that Abraham was going to sacrifice Ishmael, but the Torah says that it was Isaac? You don't know? Well, let me read you something, bro. Give me Psalms 83. Bro. Bring it out. I want to tell you, man. You are God's enemy, man. Right? All right. We got Psalms 83. We. Keep not thou silence, O God. Hold not thy peace. And be not still, O God. For lo, thine enemies make a tumult. And they that hate thee have lift up their head. They have taken crafty counsel against thy people. And consulted against thy hidden ones. They have said, come, let us cut them off from being a nation. That the name of Israel may be no more in remembrance. For they have consulted together with one consent. They are confederate against thee. So that's basically saying that this, this groups of people that has conspired against the true Hebrew Israelites. Not the fake Jews in Israel today. We're talking about us, the oppressed, right? The black, Hispanic, Native American man, woman, and child here in the Americas, man. Right? The tabernacles of Edom. The tabernacles of Edom. That's the white man, right? The so-called white man. Read. And the Ishmaelite. The Ishmaelites. So you know who Ishmael is, right? He's the he's a progenitor of the Arab man. So I bet this to tell you, man. God hates you, man. Okay. Right. That's right. And when that time comes, you are going to go into slavery, man. Bring it out. Okay.